Hello everybody, this is Tech Tech Geek, and today what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to uh, enhance your computer performance and speed by a huge advantage using one simple piece of freeware called CCleaner. It's a very simple, easy to use. To download it, you're just going to go to the CCleaner website. CCleaner, yeah, that's how you say it. And I'm just going to read this to you real quick. CCleaner is the number one tool for cleaning your Windows PC. It protects your privacy online, makes your computer faster and more secure. It, eh, easy to use and small, fast download. To download it, you obviously click download. And uh, you don't download it from a file hippo, download it from this link right here because that's just a more direct link. If you want to read some more about features, you just click this feature tab. But I will have all of this in the video description below the video. Now let's get into CCleaner. This program is very, very nice. It's well laid out. It's easily, well, it's easy to use because everything is organized in these tabs. Uh, up here, it says CCleaner.com. It says your current version. It says what computer, what operating system you're running, your service pack, your RAM, your processor speed, and some drivers. Now, this first tab gets rid of all the unnecessary files on your computer. Some you want checked and some you don't. For example, I don't use Internet Explorer, so I just have all of those checked. Uh, you're going to want to make sure everything is checked in Windows Explorer and uh, make sure all the defaults are checked on system. If you want to get rid of your desktop shortcuts, you can do that. Do not uh, check start menu shortcuts in this if you really do want to get rid of that. Uh, and you can get rid of Windows error reporting if you want to. And just don't mess with the advanced, unless if you know what it is. Under applications, that's just some extra things. The only application I have uh, installed myself is Opera, but I want to keep everything in it. Uh, make sure everything else is checked under Utility, Windows, Multimedia, and Applications. And if you have extra internet browsers, you can check those. I just ran this, so it's not going to delete that much stuff, but when I ran it a little bit ago, it deleted a whole, it deleted over 3 gigabytes worth of unneeded files. Now, to delete all these unneeded files, you just click Run Cleaner. Uh, okay you can check that not to show the message again it shouldn't take very long for me and there you go and I just ran this a couple minutes and it deleted 15.2 megabytes worth of stuff the next tab below cleaner is registry which is very very important and useful it cleans all the it cleans the registry up for you making your computer faster because over time your registry gets cluttered with all the installs and uninstalls of your files and this just gets rid of the files that's slowing down your computer and decreasing your computer performance uh, make sure everything is checked it doesn't matter if anything isn't checked you just want to simply scan for issues I just ran this so I might not have any issues Oh yeah, I do. Every time you uninstall and install a program, you will have some sort of unnecessary registry file. So you're going to want to run this at least once every two weeks, I would say. It's going to take a little bit to scan my whole entire registry. Okay, it found two files. Uh, the first time I ran this, it found over 400. So to fix these issues, you just click Fix Issues. Oh, I just click the wrong thing but you make sure they're all checked and you go over here and click fix selected issues uh, you can back up the register if you want to but it's pointless so I'm just gonna no. and I'm gonna fix the issue if you have multiple issues you, there should be a button here that says fix all issues you just want to click that one but since I only have one issue I'm gonna fix the single issue close now under tools there's three extra tabs you can uninstall a program through here which is pretty obvious if you have a program on this list that you never use I use all these programs because I just installed this operating system 
well here's an example the ask toolbar I'm gonna run the uninstaller because that uninstalled with a program yes I'm all the ask toolbar okay please wait while Windows uninstalls ask toolbar got it required and now I think it's uninstalling it 37 seconds remaining okay it's done and as you can see it removed itself from that little registry thing area so now I'm gonna go to startup and this is pretty simple if you have things that's starting up that you never use or that don't need to be starting up and just are annoying that you need to close them when you start it up you just click them and click disable you can enable them and you can delete the even possibility of them starting up for, for example I have the sidebar turned off because I never use it system restore that should restore your computer to an early point in time uh, I'm not gonna go into this because this doesn't really speed up your computer unless if you screwed it up in some sort of way and options you can get into this if you want to if I was here I'd keep everything how it is everything's pretty good unless if you for example have your stuff installed on a different drive you might want to change that uh, so yep that is how you make your computer much faster with C Cleaner. please subscribe to my videos I'm gonna be making a whole bunch of good videos on freeware and shareware and how to do stuff with your computer and all that good stuff so please subscribe comment on my video if you have any questions or just commenting on my video, whatever. And give me a thumbs up. That would help me out a lot. Thank you. Bye.